It cools me off a little bit. Um, and I actually like the extra sensory. What am I trying to say here? I don't mind the rain, because it's kind of fun. I'm gonna have to take a shower anyway, so. Or how about the rain just counts as my shower? <laughs> I know some of you guys are cringing. I will shower still. This is where I'm gonna be doing my quiet time today. If you can believe it or not, this is actually Ashley's room. Now, I don't know if my mom wants to do a grand reveal, so I won't show you anything other than the desk, but for those of you who have been with us for a while, you are familiar with Ashley's room and the way that it used to be, and it's kind of bittersweet. Um, that things have changed, all her stuff has moved out. Oh, what did she do with her dress? Now that I think about it. Seeing this little gown cover made me think of that, but I have no idea what she did with her dress. <laughs> um, she, for those of you who maybe need to get caught up, um, I'm just gonna leave my hair like this because I'm gonna do my quiet time and then take a shower. Hmm. So Ashley went on her honeymoon to Arizona. They were there for a week and now they are back in their apartment in Iowa. And if you've been on our channel, you've probably seen a bit of their apartment because I believe Ashley did an apartment tour of some sort and so in the meantime i've been at school um spent a little time in door county actually which was nice um but now i'm on my last day of fall break which our fall break was only two days so it wasn't that much but it's still better than nothing and i really appreciate it and so i'm just at home and about to do my quiet time and i'm in ashley's old room and I'm sure that my mom will want to show you how she changed things up in here, but it is bittersweet. Um, it's not filled with her books or her artwork um, or her easel, all her uh, special, I don't know, quirks and yeah, she's gone, sad. But it is a cute room now, I'll, I'll give it that. And I'm sure every time that Ashley and Johnny come over to stay, they'll be in here, which is nice. It's not like they're gone forever, people. In fact, we're actually going to go visit them this weekend. So I wonder if she'll want to vlog that. Or should I? Anyways, I'm excited to just have some time to do my quiet time. This has been something I've been really trying to prioritize because uh, my... I've, been, I've had good mental health this semester and bad. It's just been a, a nice martini shaken swirl of everything. <sighs> Do you shake a martini? I don't know anything about alcohol. <sighs> that being said, I'm excited to finally catch up with you guys. I haven't seen you in forever. <sighs> Whose fault is it? At least I take ownership. And now you're remembering that, oh right, Taylor really knows how to ramble. Correct. For some reason I thought that would give me a curly cue and it didn't. Do I have any curly cues? I think my hair might be turning wavy. And it's also turning very dark. And my eyebrows are also turning very dark. That's life. Mm. 
not sponsored, but it is my favorite flavor. You either love it or you hate it. Come on. Say hi to the vlog. Hi, working on something special for you. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> can I show them the salad I made for Johnny? Oh yeah. Wait, can you explain to them the context of what's happening? Me and Taylor are having a meeting. Johnny will be home for lunch very soon and I made him this like strawberry salad with a chicken salad wrap. Mmm. Oh, and there's a candle and everything? Well, I was gonna show this when you came because it's kind of like my fall decor. That's so cute. Where did you get that pumpkin, Hobby Lobby? Yep. Oh, nice. Uh, so, oh, focus. Hello, I am the prize. <gasps> Basically, right now, Ashley and I are creating a fall challenge, um, a fall Thanksgiving challenge that'll be coming out in November for you guys. We're creating a PDF as well as a plan to be able to have a Zoom Bible study with you all. So we're really excited about that. And we're just kind of pre prepping right now and figuring out what we need to do behind the scenes this week so that we can really study and get to know the passage and then create um, a really good track for you guys to follow. So yeah, that's what's happening. So let's stay <laughs> Stay tuned to our event on coffee and Bible time. Well, I took a shower and now I have to do some tasks before I leave to go back to school on the train, i.e. packing up, bring some things to school that I had left here at home, like my coffee maker, although it's not like I have all the hands in the world. I'm actually bringing back a rug that I got from an estate sale this weekend, so. I don't really know if I'll have room for that. But I also need to go through all my makeup and sift out what's mine and what's Ashley's because we're gonna be seeing her and she wants her makeup that she left from when I was doing her makeup for the wedding. If you didn't know, I did her makeup for her wedding day. It was so much fun. And I'm sure that when um, more pictures come out, like we'll be able to show you maybe more up close what the makeup looked like. But from the pictures that we do have, I'll insert them here. Um, and we used MAC for her face, MAC Pro Longwear um, Waterproof Foundation. And then just like um, individual Ardell lashes. Yeah, I believe that these are the ones that we used. I could be wrong. There's a lot gone because we did some for her test trial makeup. But basically what we did was we just glued on individual lashes so that she um, could have more control over the type of look that she wanted and also not be like worried that the inner corner of like a larger lash would be popping off or something like that. Am I focused? Anyways, I'm gonna use some Tartlet. And we might have also used some of this like a really old Kylie Jenner. Hello. That was just bizarre that we even have that. <laughs> um, but yeah, other than that, there's just a lot in here, so I should probably start. Definitely not as much makeup as I thought she would have, but which is it? All this needs to go to Iowa. 
I actually got these like Stila's for her wedding day. Although I will say that these aren't the sparkly ones like we thought they'd be. So we kind of just used it as a wet base to like stick other sparkles on. Um, but still, good. Go. Yeah. I have to show you my recent find at the estate sale, okay? This I got for $5. Cute little trunk. I think I'm gonna put my blankets in it and like set it at the edge of my bed. Um, it was originally marked for $10. I don't know if you can see that down there. But she gave it to me for five. So yeah, this is a really good steal. Um, and I'm currently just trying to organize my clothes that I'm gonna be leaving here. I don't know about you guys, but I feel like I have all these clothes. Okay, yeah, my closet's a disaster because it needs to be reorganized again. And it was all organized this summer. At any rate, I have all these clothes that I'm like leaving here because they're my, I don't wanna say reject clothes, but they're the clothes that I'm not gonna bring to school. So kind of reject. Like, what, why am I keeping them? If I don't like them enough to wear them to school, like all this. I think I need a little donate then. But I don't really have time for that right now, so I just have to put them on hangers, hang them up in the closet, and by the time I snap my fingers, this room's gonna be clean. I think I'm gonna just keep it right there for now. Um, I have all of my blankets in here. I have a lot. Um, and now I have the majority of the stuff in my bed all cleaned and cleared up. There's some things that I need to take to school, some things that I wanna donate. Not exactly the most clean and organized I wanted to be, but it's still better than not doing anything and just kinda like pretending that nothing was ever terrible when in fact it was so yep that's where I'm at I really wanted to laminate these leaves but I don't think I'll have time I found some giant ones like this leaf is the size of my face you see this one we're headed to the train station I gotta go back to school But luckily, I will be seeing them again next week. I am a severe homebody. It's also raining pretty hard, and I have a lot of stuff to bring. You want my raincoat? No, it's okay. No, 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 no. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Someone's picking me up from the train station.